Yeah. We all work on Akka, Akkas. Yeah. Um, if you look at my storage, they're all standing ready in Akkas. Yeah. Um, it's because it's very neutral, you can put light on there and it becomes light. Yeah. Uh, if I put white on this, it does, doesn't give light, yeah. not at all. And you can go dark, so that's why you work with the middle tone. Yeah. If you work from light, you have no middle tone, you can only make it darker. Yeah. With this kind of thing, so middle tones, you know, this is a canvas. Yeah. Canvas color is already toned, so the white is still standing out. Yeah. Um, but it's nice because if you put light in your painting, it disappears. So it is also easier working. But he makes some crazy good choices, eh? an orangey. Yeah. You see, it's still coming through the skin. Yeah, yeah. So these boxes are still heat. Yeah. So he used the heat of this color to make a quite a cool painting. So an undercolor is amazing important. Here he chose a light blue, and then he does the dark because he doesn't do much on his background. That color is actually there. Yes, it is there. Yeah. It's just open. He didn't paint total. Yeah. No, you don't need to paint total. That we learned this morning. Sometimes painting half is quite nice. He, he even draw half. Eh? Yeah. It doesn't need to be totally flat. Eh? You can even like open pieces. But I like, yeah, what I like when it's just a little dirty, I'm not so shy for it anymore. When it's too white, you're like, ooh, what shall I do? But when it is a little dirty, I can only make it better. But, but I will do, take a little bit this size. Yeah, because that is later and way easier for framing. So I always do the size. I also don't like when a painting stands and I see a very white line. Yeah. Well, my painting is very dark and it's disturbing my eye. As on the tone, light grey, not dark grey. Yeah. Um, because then they can make beautiful white skin. Yeah. Because there's a lot of white skin. Yeah. Well. Um, the Dutch do a lot of time ochre. Yeah. And if you go more down south, so Spain and Italy, they also use more reds and stronger colours yeah. under it. So I, I like to paint Australian landscapes. Yeah. What colour can be in the background? Maybe a strong colour. Yeah. Maybe a strong colour. So if you do a very strong light blue or something, don't do too dark because then it's not so easy working with colours. Mm -hmm. Then you will influence your landscape in a very, very cool atmosphere. Or if you do a very red under, you will make a very warm painting. So if you want to have this burning Australian landscape, maybe a rat will work. <laughs>